Bruh, Damian Lillard just got traded to the Bucks, bro. That shit crazy in a blockbuster trade involving the Blazers, the Bucks, and the Suns. You feel me? Bro, the Bucks got a big three. They got motherfucking Giannis, Damian Lillard, and Chris Middleton. Plus, they still got some other pieces. They got Bobby Porters, and they just got some pieces from the, um, just a whole bunch of pieces just went everywhere to the Suns, the Blazers, the Bucks. But that's crazy, Dame, Giannis, and Chris Middleton gang. That's crazy, gang. That's crazy, Dame got traded to the Bucks. Everybody thought he was going to the Heat or the Raptors, and everybody thought he was going to the Heat or the Raptors, including me. But I knew something was fishy because it was taking way too long to get the deal done. Everybody knew something was fishy. But he got what he wanted. And you feel me? He on the, for sure, a championship contender team. And Giannis got what he wanted, too. Because Giannis been complaining. That's why Milwaukee hurried up and made that deal, too. Because Giannis been complaining. So he don't want to stay in Milwaukee for 20 years. If he only going to win one championship. He ain't want to stay with them long term. If they want to keep competing for championships. Giannis been saying that he been complaining to lady too. And they ain't wanted out of Portland. So, and Chris Middleton's still there. And they got other pieces there. So, this make perfect sense for both sides, bro. And then, the Blazers got back Drew Holiday and a couple key pieces. The Suns, they gave away DeAndre Ayton and shit. I think he went to the um, Blazers and shit. This shit crazy, bro. It's just Nurkic had went to um, the Suns and shit. The Suns got a couple good key pieces back, too. They got um, Gary Allen. A lot of good pieces, bro. That shit crazy. The Bucks about to win it all, bro. I don't really see nobody in the... If they stay healthy... I don't really see nobody in their way. They really was supposed to be in the finals the last two years, but the year like the year before last, the Celtics had beat them because Chris Middleton got hurt there last year. Giannis was hurt. That's how the Heat beat them. Like if they stay healthy, if everybody stay healthy. Chris Middleton, Giannis, and um, they ain't no way why they should win a um NBA championship. They was supposed to be in the last two years. If you ask me, if it wasn't for Giannis and Chris Middleton getting hurt, ain't no way the Celtics would have beat um would have beat um. The Bucks two years ago when they went against the Warriors. Chris Middleton got hurt. He was out there in the whole series and it still went seven games without their second best player. The Celtics barely beat him. And then last year they got eliminated in the first round by the Heat. Giannis was hurt for like three games, though. If they stay healthy, man, the Bucks gonna win it all, bro. And Dame hungry for a title. Giannis and Chris Middleton hungry for more titles. You feel me? That's, you feel me? That's some shit. They can win. How old is Dame? Like 32? They can win like two, three rings together, bro. At least two on God, bro. On God, they can win at least two rings. Okay, Dave will finally have his rings. Chris Middleton and Giannis to have more rings. Like, you feel me? I see it coming to fruition. Like, I don't see nobody really can beat them. Like, I can't think of no team on the top of my dome that I can really see beating the um, Bucks. Who won't really be able to fuck with them? I know the Celtics added Chris Pratt. Chris that Porzingis, but they ain't gonna be able to fuck with the Bucks if the Bucks healthy, man. The Bucks gonna win the championship this year if they stay healthy. I'm calling it. Ain't no reason why they shouldn't.